Hey, Holy Angels family, get a little closer. So you get to see me, but I don't get to see all of you. And I miss you just as much, or maybe even a little more than what you, if you miss me. And there are some things this week that I'm going to ask you to do. And just to inform you of a few things that are hopefully going to happen soon. So the governor said that uh, he's going to start opening things up but we aren't gonna be until like phase three, four, five, six, somewhere in the, in the later uh, operation of this thing of releasing us back to somewhat normalcy. And the reason being is because when we gather, we gather in great numbers. So how would it be if he only let 50 people in the church? It'd be kind of strange and we'd be waiting for our turn. And so while we wait, we have a, more of an opportunity to pray, but also to invite God in. So we have adoration on Thursdays. We have mass on Sundays. So now we're going to add a Tuesday evening to our repertoire of things to do. So it'll be adoration with the teens and it'll be absolutely fabulous if you could join us. The more we participate in the things of the church, uh, the greater the church grows. So invite some of those family members that you prayed for last week. Invite them to participate this week. Participate in Sunday Mass, Tuesday or Thursday Adoration. It's something that we can do in a way that we can show them that the things we do allow God to be present to us. Oh, by the way, another way of being present to us is remember those fish fries we couldn't have because of this virus thing going on? Well, with the opening up of some things, we are going to have a drive through fish fry. So you drive up, you place your order, we, we run it in, the ticket in, we get your food ready, you drive down the driveway a little bit, you grab your food, and you're free to go. So you know like how you've been stopping in at McDonald's and all those other places? Well, this is something that we should have done back during Lent. So you're not restricted to fish this time though. So you can, can have pepperoni on your pizza. You can order a hot dog. You can even order a hamburger. It'll come with french fries and coleslaw. And the only thing we're waiting on is a couple of signs and a few other pieces to go with this. And pay by cash or credit card. So another thing is that if you need help, please say something. Doesn't matter what it is. Any kind of help, we're here for you. We're family. That's what family does. So if you need something, anything, please let us know. Give us a call, leave a message, or talk to somebody if it's urgent. I want to also thank you for your contributions, your prayers, your offering, and everything that we do as a community. Your prayers are especially fruitful. Thank you. Keep up the good work. Keep participating in community and allow God's grace to bless both you and us by keeping your faithfulness to keeping his church. Let's look forward to the things that we get to do. But let us be mindful of using our time wisely, of using this time for God. It's a once in a lifetime opportunity. Let's look back at it and say, yes, we did something good with the time. Good with the time that we had no distractions. So we have the fish fry, we're praying for people. Let's pray for our church and the members of our church that God keeps us safe and that God allows us to have a deep desire for him, that we come back fervent in hope and faith and in love. There's only a few things to share with you this week, but the main thing is hope. May we love him with our whole being. And may you stay healthy, stay steadfast in prayer. May you trust in his love. I love you, I miss you, God bless you.